Didn't I play this already? Ah, oh, seriously, dude, it didn't save. Fuck. Been a busy night. Good to see you on your feet again. Just the same answers. Here, you're welcome. It's information on Harleen Quinzel from Seal Records. We dug up at the coroner's office. Harleen Quinzel's father committed suicide after decades of struggling with mental illness. A yeah, tough story. Quinzel was a devoted, successful doctor. But she couldn't save her. Must have been hard on her. The trauma of her father's death caused her breakdown. Turned her into the monster she is today. Now, I know what she's done, but I can't help but feel a little sorry for her. It's gotta be rough on a person, going through all that. People are traumatized every day, Jim. Most find a way of dealing with it without having to bash people with a hammer. <laughs> I guess you're right. Gordon, you're dismissed. This is still my goddamn station house. He's forgetting I'm the one who can make or break his career right now. You only remind me every other minute. Clearly, I need a better method of getting the message across. You're both behaving like children. Watch your tone, Batman. Or what? You'll put him on timeout? I've been lenient with you so far, but don't push me. She's got some kind of leverage on you, doesn't she? If she's jammed you up somehow, just say the word. I'll appeal to the mayor, the governor, whatever it takes to get her off your back. I I'll do whatever I can to help you. She knows who I am, Jim. Oh, yeah? Well, so do I. You're Batman. That's all you ever have to be. That's all Gotham needs you to be. And you, if you're threatening to take that away, you should be ashamed of yourself. I don't want to hear it. Just supposed to come to Gotham, put the chains on Riddler and his gang, and get the hell out. I'm just saying, this city gets under your skin. Fast. Know what I mean? Best laid plans and all that. You didn't choose this profession because it's easy. You do the job, or you don't. You're absolutely right. I guess you locals see it differently. <clears throat> Agent of Esther. She fought to get on this assignment, you know? Wanted to see her old neighborhood, wanted to see you, her hometown hero. She wanted to impress you. She admires what you do for the people of this city. Your respect is important to her. She certainly succeeded on that front. She's one of my best. Still, wanting to impress you, it's the same thing that made her move too fast on Riddler. Now there's a lesson learned. So, Wayne Enterprises. Heard you made some new friends. You're having me followed. Thanks to you, these very bad people have an EMP and a key that'll open every lock I would want to keep bolted shut. They're clearly planning something. The stakes are too high to leave anything to chance. You know, I actually considered asking you to infiltrate Riddler's gang. Before everything blew up, I knew I could count on you to get me close to them. Close to Bane. You're good at this. Seems like you've already won Harley Quinn's trust. Putting a tail on me jeopardizes the mission. Call it off. You're right. I will. Get them away from their base of operations. Somewhere, they'll be exposed. When they're all together, out in the open, contact me. I'll be standing by. Ready to ambush. We'll take them down when they're at their most vulnerable. Sound good? They'll never know what hit them. If we do this, 
I want to guarantee that no one gets killed. No one dies. No one has to join murder gangs run by maniacs either. Look, I know your code against killing, but I won't risk my agent's safety for a band of sociopaths. Batman, if it gets bad for you, just remember, we're out here. When you're in deep like this, you need friends. Let's say everything goes pear-shaped, and you get stuck in there longer than you'd like. Then what's right, what's wrong, it all gets blurry. And guess what? That's okay. Because you're going to have to do some blurry things that you're not proud of before this is done. You hear me? That's just how these kinds of operations go down. I created Batman to strike fear into criminals, not become one. Batman's not the one rubbing shoulders with them at the moment. You should think about which one Gotham really needs right now. Al, I'm in. Just don't stay embedded any longer than necessary. I'll be in and out, Alfred. Just long enough to figure out their plans. Good luck, Bruce. Stay safe. All right. What Here if we go? Wearing? Welcome to our little hideaway and home away from home, the end of the line. We're happy to have you. Thanks, John. You said you'd kill him after you got what you needed. So what? Ain't a girl allowed to change her mind? Could someone get me out of these handcuffs, please? Tell me why I shouldn't kill you. <sighs> What I have is influence, and that is worth a lot. <laughs> Spoken like a man who has never had to do hard work. <laughs> who the hell wants to do hard work? I bring us back the transport and the arms we require. You, you bring back a worthless aristocrat. We don't need his money. We have what we need to finish this, thanks to me. He ain't worthless, you overgrown bicep. He already got us an EMP device and the failing scheme. I'll betcha I can find a use for him. I do not care how much these two swoon over you, Wayne. We don't want you here, and we don't need you here. Ah! Whoopsie. What the hell? John, <laughs> turn it off! Turn it off! Now! Can you do something about this? It's freeze. What have you done? You need to uncuff me. Don't screw this up. You fool! I can turn it off. Make it stop, or I will seal you both in ice! I swear, if you don't get that electricity back on immediately, I'll send you to a frozen hell. I turned this one off. Yeah, I'm confused. Fuck. I know all 
these are fun. Huh? We know that it works. I must check on Nora. See how she is. You may have impressed these two, but I haven't made up my mind about crushing your skull. Fair enough. Everyone back to work. There's still a lot to get done. Who put you in charge? Somebody has to give the orders. That was a nice job before. Come on up to my office. Listen, Bruce. I just want to clear the air a little. You distanced yourself from us back at your office. I don't blame you, after all the trouble I caused. You probably noticed I like to stir things up. It's a bad habit, and, well, it's made me more enemies than friends. I want to say I'm sorry for messing with your people. Your employees. I know they probably mean a lot to you. Thank you, Harley. Your apology means a lot. Really? You probably think I'm a terrible person, but I want you to understand. You seen these animals I work with? In my business, you let your guard down for a second, you get torn to shreds. I can only imagine. If I'm always pushing buttons, it's to keep people off balance, you know? Keep them guessing my next move. Keep the real me hidden. I hope you ain't gonna judge me for it. To be honest, I've been at it so long, I don't even notice I'm doing it. I'll be honest, Harley, I wasn't sure what to make of you. I'm impressed. I'm gonna take that as a compliment. But don't push your luck. You ain't like these others. Bane's a powder keg, Freeze. <laughs> well, you saw Freeze. John's sweet, and believe me, he's got heaps of potential. But he's still a growing boy. You, though, you got your head screwed on right. You're reasonable. I can work with reasonable. We're pulling a job tonight. I want you to be a part of it. You already showed you know how to use that EMP better than any of these other clowns. I want you to come with. I'm in. Just tell me what to do. That's what I wanted to hear. All will be revealed eventually. Using that EMP, though, that's gonna make tonight's job a whole lot less messy. And that no-neck asshat Bane, he loves making a mess. <laughs> People getting killed just makes his day. If you're gonna come with, you gotta convince the others. Convince them? It's a real pain in the ass sometimes, but you need a majority opinion for anything big. And bringing you along, well, you got some persuading to do. Let me know how I can help. So what's the deal with Freeze? He's... unique. You mean why he's blue and wrapped up in machinery? Accident in the lab. Here's the thing about Freeze. Only thing he gives two hoots about is his wife. He gave up everything to try and save her when she got sick. And I mean everything. Job, health, soul, the whole shebang. She's dead. Frozen stiff. Keeps her on ice in the next room while he searches for a cure. Ain't that just kooky? I mean, it explains why he flipped when the EMP went off. But seriously, who does that? I know, right? That was my reaction the first time I heard. Talking about his wife is the only way to get Freeze to pay attention to you. 
But watch yourself. His attention ain't always a good thing. I get the feeling Bane doesn't like me very much. That knucklehead respects strength and loyalty. Show me got those, and he'll come around. He's a man's man. I don't got much time for all that burly machismo, but sit him down for a beer or something. He'll hear what you gotta say. He may kill you when you're done, but at least he'll listen. Yeah, I'm not gonna bring up the father. I'll go talk to the others. See what I can do to change their minds. I've got faith in you, handsome. sensing from this group. Where's John? I'm, I want to go talk to him first. Uh, maybe he's not even here. so good to see you like so good always good to see you john i've been wanting to say bruce thanks for helping me out before <laughs> and your office making me look good hey i'm just glad everything worked out did it ever handing that key over to harley giving her what she wanted pure ecstasy it, yeah, it was a big moment for me I should have known right when we pinky sweared that everything would work out great. Harley wants me to try to get in good with Bane and Freeze. I think you're well on your way to doing just that. And I've been doing, you know, what I can to uh, help, too. You didn't catch it? <laughs> it looked like Bane might kill you. I set off that EMP, you know, as a distraction. I thought it might give you a chance to show off your technical skills in front of Freeze. Well, then... I owe you my life, John. It's what pals do. I know you do the same for me. And wouldn't you know it, you nailed it. You already know I like you, Bruce. You better get cracking on getting those other guys to like you, too. Because I don't want to have to watch what happens if they don't. loves that beer. I bought some for when I need to talk to him. He's scarier than anybody in Arkham. Cool, thanks. Didn't even think about that. You look thirsty. Please, come. 
Riddler, he bombed your building and killed your friend. Someone did that to me. I'd bomb their building, kill their friend. As Riddler's friend, I have to know, are you here for payback? Did you come for revenge? Answer me, or I will break you in half. The payback I want is with the agency. They wronged me, and now I want to make it right. I'm sure you understand. Riddler studied this Waller woman, profiled her. She is arrogant, presumptuous, and she won't see what we have planned coming. If you want to get back at the agency, we at least have that in common. In this line of work, one cannot be too careful. Trust has been the hardest thing to find, especially after Riddler's death. We'll see if you can be trusted, Wayne, very soon. Cool. Where are you going? You clicked on me. Now I see where Bane gets his fashion sense. me if you're smart and understand the concept of self-preservation I know pain what it's like to lose a loved one I can't imagine anyone knowing anything like what I've experienced but I do know of your family tragedy perhaps you may know what it's like what if you get caught Sent to prison. What happens to your wife then? What do you propose? I have no idea. Ugh. I own technology companies, Victor. Big ones. You could house and protect her. Continue your research to cure her. Why? Why would you do this? Your wife deserves it, right? The innocent deserve our protection. You're right about that much. I'll talk to Bane. Make sure he thinks you're on the level. You have my word. I may have misjudged you. Wait! Good luck. He was with my crew at the police arsenal. Bane! The prisoner he was supposed to be guarding got away. And yet he doesn't have a scratch on him. This is crazy! I suspect we have a traitor among us. One begins to smell a rat after Riddler's murder and that prisoner getting away. Loyalty is all that we have. But there can be no trust unless I can believe that you are who you say you are and that you are really willing to do all that you claim. Only one of you walks out of here. You know me. The sooner one of you picks up that pipe and bashes the other's head, the sooner we get this over with. Fine. I'll prove it. I mean, he can get it. Right now. Oh shit! Never mind. <laughs> I thought I was gonna counter whatever he attacked me with. He was with my crew at the police arsenal. Bane! The prisoner he was supposed to be guarding got away. And yet he doesn't have a scratch on him. This is crazy! I suspect we have a traitor among us. One begins to smell a rat after Riddler's murder 
and that prisoner getting away. Loyalty is all that we have. But there can be no trust unless I can believe that you are who you say you are, and that you are really willing to do all that you claim. Only one of you walks out of here. You know me. The sooner one of you picks up that pipe and bashes the other's head, the sooner we get this over with. Fine. I'll prove it! What's going on? The job we've been getting ready for. It's happening. Good. I'm ready. Not so fast, the money bags. You're not in the pact. Not yet. Not till everyone votes. What do you say, boys? Bruce Wayne. In or out? The aristocrat likes the backbone to dirty his hands. Out. There may be more to Wayne than first appears. He can be trusted. In. Bruce is strong and smart and handsome. Like, super handsome. It's nuts, you guys. And <laughs> where was I going with this? Right, right. I vote in. Well, aren't you, Mr. Popular? We got a majority, folks. Bruce is in. You've earned a ticket to ride, pal. Make sure that EMP shield in is on those APCs. I don't need any surprises. Time to get that package. Remember, when we work together, no one can stop us. When we work together, the world yeah! can be ours! Let's go! Somebody grab that thing, it's important. Let's go hit him with the hind! We are close. Make your device ready. Will do. EMP primed and ready to go. Harley. Yeah? What? We have almost reached the target vehicle. Uh huh? What? No. You are oh. providing our escape. Yeah. Waller. On the move with targets. Track the signal. Get your people here now. We've got your signal locked. Cavalry is on the way. <laughs> now we do this. Wait, what in the... I gotta say, Bruce, now that we're actually here and it's really happening, I'm feeling some butterflies in my stomach. We have an obstruction ahead, both lanes. Armored vehicles. Service weapons at the ready. Do not engage. Now, Wayne! Do it! What was the hell is going on? HQ, do you copy? My gun, it's fried! All comms are down. Move! Carry the torch, Mr. Shoot. Stay sharp! Secure the vehicle!
Face it, you're outmatched. Nobody has to die here. Your place is on the perimeter. Keep... Yeah, yeah. Freeze, open the door. Everyone, stay sharp and keep order. Allow no sudden moves and no talk. Strike it. Go on, quickly. You're wondering what's in there. Find out for yourself. Back off, or I'll shoot. No, no, no! Don't. Break it off! We don't have time for this. We're not done here, Wayne. I would not turn my back on him. I'll leave this clean up to you, but hurry. Men, seize the cargo. Get out of here! Waller, where are you? Waller here. Let them have it, Wayne. What are you talking about? The package. Let them have it. It's not worth my agent's lives. You can't be serious. You were supposed to be here. No! That was my ride! Break out the artillery and disable their vehicles! To choose Harley. I'm gonna play whack a mole with their heads. They say warriors death. Harley. Rosie, come join the fun. We'll keep your arms and legs inside. What do you want with us? Stay down. Woo! Well, that was fun. Kinda. Be a sweetheart and give me a hand with the luggage.
nice work back there, Brucey boy. You really know how to show a girl a good time. Have your fun now. Oof, the Iceman bummeth. If Bane survives, he'll make us all pay for abandoning him. Bane will survive, and he won't let this slip. He's probably having a ball, cracking skulls. He knew the risks. Bane shouldn't have put himself in that situation. It's his, it's his fault. fault. He's in a pickle. In a pickle. Be careful. You might wind up in a similar situation one day. All right. We got the package. Be grateful you're around to see it. <laughs> Intrigued, Brucie? Want to know what's inside? Go on. Yes. Open it. For what? I thought he stank when he was alive. You really put us through a lot of trouble, Mr. Smarty Pants. Getting yourself killed like that. We needed you for the next stage. I've got what you need. For the right price. Conversation in the parlor left them feeling useless. Wait, is that my phone? I'm curious, how did that 0.2% manage to do the other thing? That's a lot, dude, 99.8%. Good episode. Like it.